a beautiful January cold brisk morning on the Ohio River. I'm here with Ricky Eiselt. You love to target big catfish and you've been sending me pictures of giant catfish, right? Yeah, we've, we've caught some pretty good fish this month. We've caught a 80 pounder, uh, I think three or four over 50 pounds. We've had a couple 60 pounds. So it's it's been pretty good this month, so. Wintertime's a great time to catch a giant. Yeah. A lot of people don't understand that. I mean, we're out here today, it's 24 degrees, and this is a great situation, great conditions to catch catfish and potentially a big one. Correct. Hopefully we put a good sized fish in the boat. You know? We're gonna try to, I'll do my best. All right, let's do it. So I like to scale my bait, which where these been sitting in there on that ice, they're about half frozen here. All right. Perfect. It's a catchable fish. You want to get this one, Chad? Just take your time with him because they're kind of coming up out of deep water. Let me take this reel down for me. Oh, yeah. I'm going to go oh, over yeah. you. You got it. Feels like it could be a 12 or 15 pounder. Yeah, it feels like a pretty good fish. I like those big fish. A lot of times you'll get that big fish and he'll come toward you. And once you get him under the boat, it's, you just can't get him up off the bottom. I'm gonna grab the bogus and we'll boga grip him. We won't use the net. That's about a 20 pounder. It's not a bad fish. Not a bad fish at all. What a beautiful fish. I tell you what, there's nothing like fighting one of these, and I can't imagine. You caught a 92? I caught a 92 in 2009. We've caught an 89, an 80, uh, a few in the 70s. It's been a pretty good year. There he goes. We're off to a little bit of a start. Here's a fish, he's, he's catchable. Fish we on. We got another one. That one there hit one of the stakes, didn't it? Yeah, he took that little chunk I just put on there. For guys that, you know, is looking to eat fish, that, that size there, that's the size you want to eat. Oh yeah. Them big fish, you know, turn them loose and let them grow. Not to mention, they're just better table fare. Look at, this. Look at this. Look at this. This is a good one. This is a big one. Here, Chad. No, go ahead, No, man. here, take it, buddy. I catch them all the time. Let me catch up That's to on that mega head. I oh, know, he's coming in a little easier than I thought. He might not be as big as the other one. I'm telling you right now, this, I think there's something about the sunlight. Ricky, oh, I'm, I'm telling you, the sunlight come out and all of a sudden. I've seen it days out there, you know, it, it change up. He wasn't, he wasn't a big one. I thought he was. That's our best under, well, that 18 pounder is probably under two, but that's our best under fish. That's, that's what you want if he was out here. Tournament fishing and you had your over, then you, this is what you'd be looking for, a bunch of those. Under is under what, 34? 35, 35 in Kentucky. Okay. 30, 34 if you're on Tennessee River. Okay. I would say he's gonna be about 30, 30 inches, uh, but that's only maybe a, 10 pound, 12 pound fish. So it's uh, the inches is what you, in tournaments you're, you're looking at. That's only about 28 inches. So you would, you were allowed one per person over 35. And then if you were, you'd want, you'd want your three, three a piece for three for unders, right? correct. Yeah. I'll throw this in the box too. Watch your foot just one second.
There it is. Oh. That's a big fish. Get it, get it, big fish, big fish. Pull. All right, baby. That's a good fish. He's coming right at you, like I said. He you see him coming smoke right the drag? He's coming right at him. He was pulling drag. Keep pulling, keep reeling until you get caught up with him. Okay. This is a good fish here. It smoked it, Chad, didn't it? He's definitely on there. But keep I, going. You ain't I caught up with him yet. I this is going to yeah, be a good really fish. I haven't really felt the weight yet. Take your time with him. He didn't play around either, did he? No, just like I said, look at the bubbles. Yep. That's about a 30 pounder. Good job, buddy. Yes, sir. Awesome. That was great. We're looking for one about twice that size. But <laughs> that's our best one today. Look at that fish. You talked about fish running at you. Yeah, that's exactly and what I, he did. I'm like, this, this fish doesn't feel that big. And he kept coming and kept coming and kept coming. And then when he got into the boat, it was all of a sudden. Yeah. And if it would have been, if he'd have been double that size, once you got him here, he would have kept going up river. You're just holding on at that point, And that's when it gets fun. But that's a good fish, man. That, awesome job. Man, thank you so much. That is a good fish. I'll take that all day long. About 31, 32 pounds. What a fish. I mean, they, they, it's just incredible. That's what we're after. And you're that. fighting them, and they're in their element in the water, and you're trying to pull them up. You're going wherever they want to go until they get tired, aren't you? Oh, yeah. Blue, blue cats are some of the funnest fish you're going to catch, you know, fresh water. It's a good fish. Good that fish. was awesome. You know what? I know for, for what you're used to, it wasn't the greatest of day. But for most people to come out here, this is January. Yeah. And catch this type of quality fish. That's a great day. Yeah, I'm, I've had a lot worse days, so we didn't get what I come for, but I'm satisfied. You know, you listen to a country song, you think that you can only catch catfish in the summer sitting on a bank. You've showed me today that maybe the best time to come out and get them, middle of the winter. That's, I think that's the best time for the bigger fish. Yeah. Well, let's get these back in. Man, it's been a great day, thank you. Yeah, my pleasure.